Alright guys, we are back with Last Prom. Not the Last Prom, as I've been calling it, it's just Last Prom. It doesn't sound like Apocalypse or prom Apocalypse or something where it's like the last of proms or something. You know? I don't know. So anyways, I had to replay everything. That's why I'm a little bit further behind than I was before. I don't know why, but you know what? I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. So anyways, we're going to the computer lab, where we shall meet Sadako, and she shall try to kill us. We'll be like, nope. And then she'll kill us anyways, because we have no authority over her. And that's just how life works. And that's where babies come from. So let's skip past this, because we've already seen this before. Hey look, it's the Grudge Girl. Oh no, Grudge Girl, no. No way is that. It's coming towards me. G gotta run. You know what? I knew I was supposed to run. You didn't have to take extra time. Hey look, I'll try the second door. And hopefully that'll work. Does it? Probably not. It didn't. Well, shit. Game over. Yeah. So anyways, I guess that means it's time to check the third one. Oh, maybe I can hide in here. I definitely won't die. Spoiler alert, I die. Oh. Yep. Watch it be the last one in there. If it is, I will be so... Actually, you know what? I'm going to try the last one next. If it's not the last one, then I will also be rather upset because that would mean that I just wasted more of my time by being an asshole. I like how she just kind of spasms around sometimes. It actually makes it a little bit easier to run away from her. You know, I'm gonna try this one. Because I have a feeling that tonight's gonna be a good night. That tonight's gonna be a good, good night. I was wrong. I was so very wrong. Tonight is going to be fucking awful. Girls' restroom. Gotta hide. Maybe I can hide in here. It's better work. What the fuck? What the actual fuck? What the actual fuck? Seriously? What the fuck do you expect me to do, you piece of ass shit fucker? I was pressing the wrong button. God damn it. Uh, I'll be honest. I didn't see anything else to do in there. I just saw bathrooms. I'm pretty sure that's all that is in there. Bathrooms. No other type of super secret hidden thing I can do. Unless maybe you want me to go to the, um... Yeah, that's the only option I have. Alright, maybe I can hide in here. So I'm guessing I just can't hide in here. Because it's just not working. Yep. Thank you. Good game, everyone. 
Great game. There's nothing says good game design like trial and error. It's the best, I tell you. Hey, Sadako. I'm gonna read this, and you're gonna be okay with it. Subject teachers. English. Fujimoto. G. I'm a shocky. You. Eh. Uh, fuck this. Boy, howdy. How's it going? Oh god. I taunted her too much. Now she's gonna grudge the fuck out of me. I feel grudged. Oh wait, yeah, the stairs do that. I remember now! Fuck the stairs! Ugh. Was there any room that had a, a key to that I could just go into? Maybe I can, like, drive her out of that one place, lock myself in the computer lab or something? Could, could that work? Or is that just stupid? I'm gonna go with the obvious answer and say that's just stupid. What do I do? Where should I hide? The drawers are empty. Does this work? What? Oh, sweet Jigas. Is she gone? Thank you, based god. Thank you. What the hell was that thing? She looks like the girl from the grudge. It's cause she was. Good thing she's gone now. Fuck that, I'm saving. I'm gonna end this part right here. Though that won't make any difference for you, so I do not know why I'm saying it. Anyways, boop. Howdy. I'm back. All right. Hey, it's you again. You lofty bitch. What was it again? You don't have a nose, and that really disconcerns me. I'm just going to say that. Actually, I don't think anyone here has a nose. And that is quite possibly the scariest thing about this. J19. Looks like you've been chased by that thing. <laughs> you again. Yep. Surprised to see you again. Aren't you happy to see me? A fuck ton of dots, which means fuck you. So how's it going then? Oh, fine. I just got chased around by some grudge girl. Actually, it was the grudge girl. The fucking grudge girl. So how was your fucking day? Not in the mood right now. Ah, is that so? You have better learn about the girl in the white dress. Or else, you'll get a bad end in this game. Bad end? This game? What do you mean? Are they breaking the fourth wall because... I don't know if I like the way they're doing it. It's not that bad, but it's not... Eh. It's kinda cool. Well, if your existence in the real world can be gone, if you can't survive under her curse... What? My existence... can be gone? I'm not sure what she meant. What shall I do to make myself survive at this place, then? Hmm. Let's see. Gotta scoop my chair up. I don't know. With a little squiggly, which means you say with a little... What's the word? Lewd tone. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Senpai Kawaii. Yeah. What? Well, I don't know about the school much, you see. I didn't mean the school. I meant the cursed school that you're talking about. There's still schools. And who is the girl in the white dress? She keeps saying help whenever we meet. I'm not sure what she meant about that. It couldn't possibly be anything about the fact that she was murdered on this school and is probably being chased around by some sort of, like, the person who killed her, you know? 
This can't possibly be true. I'm not sure what you meant about that. What exact school are you from? I've never seen that uniform before. Ah, this is from the other world. Fuck you. Other world? There are some things that you don't need to know. Is this like a fucking self-insert or something? Because I swear to fucking Christ if it is. If that's so, then why are you here anyway? I'm here to watch you and come coming by if you need anything. I'm guessing that you don't need anything yet. So, I'll have to go back and wait until then. If you're gonna make a video game, don't do a goddamn motherfucking self-insert! Seriously, that should be illegal. Actually, I think it is illegal. Well, I'm gonna make a country. We're gonna make that illegal. Alright. All petition to join that country say aye! Unlock practice house. Hey, look, we're practicing. Cool. Shut up, phone. What the hell do they practice in here? Oh, I was right. Hand jobs. All right, now, Billy, you need to. Okay, yeah, we're not doing that. Computer's not working. All right, you need to get yourself some new computers. Okay. Kitchen? What the fuck? Why is there... Why does this place connect to the kitchen? Why are these chairs different? Why am I here? Why did I unlock this place? Just... What the hell? Why would you... Why is that incorporated? Why? What the fuck? What the actual fuck? <sighs> Maybe this will do something. It won't. I know it won't. It's just some really creepy fan service. But, whatever. It might. I am so disturbed by everything that goes on in this fucking room. What kind of motherfucking fan service is that? Satan's fan service. Evil fan service. The worst kind of fan service. Yeah. Doors are empty. The bouncy boy, did you see him to me today? Whatever. Can't read what it says. Too dark for me to read. I feel something. I'm an idiot! Oh, senpai! Grudge girl! I gotta give it. This music is fucking terrifying. I just... It's really actually scary. But seriously. Why did I have to go to that room? Hey, look! Music! Cool! Pinner! Can't see anything. Oh, well, that's probably good. That way, the spooky, scary skeleton mans can't spook you. We don't want that, do we? Oh yeah, I probably get like something over here. Take item X. Put it with item B. Oh no? What the? The fuck? What the fuck? Did, are you see? Did you see that? Did you see the text there? Utterly unacceptable. Utterly. Unacceptable. But glad to see we're changing things up. Even if it's just slightly. Hey. You have a shitty kitchen. 
I can't read what it said. It's too dark for me to read. Let's take a flashlight out. Coin fuck. Thank you, Betty Crocker. The Batter Witch is here to save us. Hooray! Collect all. I need to collect all four pieces of paper. Oh, alright then. So, pretty much, you're not gonna tell what the paper is, you're just gonna say, Here, take paper. Cool, storage room key. Well, what do I do here? Toolbox. I wind up. This music box is so cute. Is it playing any music? Huh? And that's a okay? Watch it be the title screen music. Wait a minute. Oh. Oh. I bet you like five bucks it could be the title screen music. Shake hands. You sure. Guess who just won five dollars. Guess who just won five fucking dollars. Somehow the music is so beautiful. Something inside. Small diary notebook. <clears throat> I never had any friends. No one likes me. Not even one. Except for her. My one and only friend. Clara Oswald. I can't believe she's the only one who likes me, even I look weird to everyone. She's the only one who understands me. We were so happy together. But, not too long. The other page has been torn out. Oh, fucking course it is. It always has to be torn out, doesn't it? No one likes me. Don't play this stuff, man. People love you. We're so happy together. But not too long. You gonna finish your sentence there? Wait a second. Is that the girl? She has a fucking white dress. What do you think? She's a ghost, goddammit. You should know. She's not the... Okay, I guess there's two ghosts here. Well, I guess, I'm not sure if the Grudge Girl and her are different characters or the same entity, but I am under the assumption that because of the fact that they are both wearing red dresses, not red dresses, it's not fucking corpse party. Judging by the fact that both wearing white dresses, I'd assume that they are both the same person. Someone's crying. That is true. I'll be honest, I don't have my earbuds in. The music is actually... Pretty scary. See, what do I get on the key to? Storage room key! You're gonna keep playing this crying music on loop, aren't you, until I find something out. But, I'm going to guess and say that you. Not the math department, you want me to go to the storage room! Alright then. I know that sound is coming from the re- Oh, actually, that, that's very helpful, thank you. Where was the reading center again? Where would that be again? I don't know. Alright. So pretty much I have a phobia of seeing penises, even though there's nobody here except me. Some random self-insert girl and ghost girl. None of which people have penises, so I don't know why I'm afraid. Actually, I'm not sure about that. Actually, it sounds scary when I have, like, my earbuds... No, 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 I'll say it later. Um, excuse me. Sup? You have green hair and it's nice. Mika! Violet! You sound like a woman when you're crying. 
Mika Violet! Mika, why are you crying? For once, you're not playing the guitar in the background. Well, that's because the guitar guy is gone. School's over. I'm scared. Even this is our school. I'm scared. I'm still scared. It's alright, Mika. I'm here for you. You can relax now. You're just so lucky. You're not even afraid of this place. You didn't cry either. I wish I could be a... a La, 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 la. I wish I could speak fluently in the goddamn language I was born into. I wish I could be as brave as you are. Aw, oh, come on, don't cry. You can be brave, you know. So please stop crying. Sub sub. It didn't show her face, and so that unnerves me to a great extent. An extent that you cannot even. Well, actually, I won't say you can't fathom, because that's actually pretty douchey to say. But. Fucking unsettles me. Well, at least you're here, so I don't need to worry. That's the spirit. Well, let's gather together. Right. Hmm. What's the matter? Mika. There's a little stain on your dress. Wait. Is that blood? I knew this wouldn't work out. Actually, I didn't. I'm lying. I'm blatantly lying. It's the reason why the guitar guy is not here. That's not her. Guitar guy is always here when it's her. I wasn't looking to where I am going, so I tripped on the hallway. And fucked up my English. Then my knee started to bleed. Oh, is that so? Well, you we better heal that before it gets worse. There are some medicines in the clinic. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, there are some med- Do I have some medicines in the clinic? But it's not. Can you stand a little longer? I guess I can, though. Alright, then let's go. Mika, you have some of the worst grammar in this entire video game. Well, sure. Do you have any music box back at your home? I'd like to buy, like, three grams of music box. Well, no. Why? Huh. Are you sure you don't? Well, Mom won't let me have one. She says that music boxes are like a gateway drug to heroin. It's too expensive, she said. And I never hold any music box before. Wait a minute. Why are you asking me this kind of question anyways? Oh, I, I was just wondering. He, he. If I told her the truth that I'm looking for her things, that I'm lacking her things off in her room, I'm sure she'll be mad. It's not hers. She doesn't have a freaking music box. Oh, you're coming to that conclusion yourself. Sorry for being an asshole. But if she never hold a music box before, which means she never know about that small key too, but why is that key... In her room. Because. Digigam. Digigam game so strong. Alright. So. How long has this been. Oh I'm going to have to end this episode right here. So. Yeah. I'm going to end this episode right here. And remember. No trolls and no. Well I think I've already said grudge girls. No going into boys' bathrooms, you might see a penis. I have been to boys' bathrooms in my days, as I'm a boy, and I have seen- Actually, I'm a grown man. I'm a grown motherfucking man! Anyways, I have seen things that I cannot tell you about. They're all penises. All of them. Anyways, it's the end of episode here. Blah, 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 blah. It was a dream. Peace out. Oh, bye, bye, bye.